Hey everybody, welcome back to the Dooley's Dudes Podcast. Um, today we're in my basement and we have uh, Ian here who uh, had an idea to do a podcast today. So I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to leave it to him for most of this. Alright, I know it's been quite a bit since we had a podcast. Uh, I would say the beginning of freshman year, right? Mm, the last one we had was sophomore. Sophomore year? I think. Oh yeah, at, at Toby's house. Yeah, because we were at Toby's house. Oh dude, I wasn't there for that. Wasn't that crazy? Yeah, I think it was just me, Billy, and Toby. All right, we should probably speak to Mike, because it's been a while. And we got new equipment, which is... Yeah, a little bit. It's pretty fire, dude. So, Diego, tell me, what's been on your mind recently? On my mind recently? Yeah, look, I, I was... All right, let's talk about your newest video first, actually. My newest video. Your newest video, I want to start a band, correct? Yeah, so the time that this will probably go up, um, as of right now, my most recent video is want to start a band. I'm working on another one with a, has Ian in it. It's okay. going to basically be the same kind of theme. Um, that one should be called Let's Do It, I think. And, um, well, I recently came back from... Uh, Oregon, uh, Beaverton, Oregon, because the whole pandemic thing, and um, I don't know, cause something just kind of sparked, and I was like, you know, why, why don't we just, why don't we start a band? Right, I, I understand that. Uh, so, you've had this idea yourself, or was it a joint con- like idea of, with everyone in the group chat? Um, uh... Since I was little, I th- my mom always told me to start a band, kind of just as a joke, you know, it'd be fun. Right. And I always thought it'd, it'd be a cool idea, but I never actually did anything about it. Um, and just recently I was like, eh, i kind of sick of it, I kind of just want to start a band. Right, it seems like a creative outlet that might be good for you. Yeah. It might be good for all of us. I, I hope so. All right. So this virus, it's pretty crazy and all, but... We're all living, most of us at least. Uh, so, so, some people have been kind of perishing, quarantined. <laughs> yeah. Okay. I'll fuck with you if you know who you are. Oh. Oh. Is that a Toby reference? Yeah. Dude, it's a joke. It's a meme, dude. He's probably not gonna watch it. it doesn't matter. It, I mean, just in case, though. Okay. All right. All right. Just all right. I, I, he should know that we're just fucking with him, though. Right. But yeah, we've all been getting jobs. I have a job now, making that bank. At? Uh, the NARPS. <laughs> yes. Um, I am focusing on school right now um, because yeah, I, I've been, I think, freshman year to um, junior year, I've had kind of been sucking pretty hard, so I'm trying to pick it up. But halfway through junior year, you went to Oregon, so... Yeah, and then my grade skyrocketed and went from an F student to an A student, so I'm just trying to keep up with that. Um, um, you know, I'm just probably going to wait for this whole pandemic until I get a job again, but I'm not sure. Probably just until summer, at least. Summer is coming up soon, the end of the month, right? Because today it. is May 5th, and school's around, ends around the end of the month. So hopefully it ends soon. Hopefully, yeah. Because I'm tired of this work. <laughs> uh, let's talk about the basement, unless you have something you want to tell me. No, the basement sounds like a good start to spot. Um, or spot to start. <laughs> My bad. <laughs> so, I have this spot area thing in my basement. Um, it was kind of just like a cleared out space. Um, it was going to be a photography studio uh, where this lady just did uh, pictures for people and like set up like a whole bunch of green screen stuff and whatever and um well she got in an argument with my mother and left all her stuff here so we have this giant pile of stuff that she's not going to come back for so and it's now property of 35 a.m it's like what i like to say <laughs> we confiscated it <laughs> and um i had an idea to just have kind of a hangout spot because we don't really have that, and most, I, f- I feel like most friend groups, if not just like, everyone has that one spot they always go to, to, to kind of hang out, and I was like, I don't, I don't have that. I mean, the butt end, we used to go to Perry Farm. Yeah, that's that, that's where it used to be. Yeah, but then, 
and we're kind of turning into some shut-ins, so I was like, eh, it, it should be, the ideal should be couch TV. That, this, that's, that's all you need, really. Yeah, and so I had an idea to have it um, upstairs in this uh, storage area, but I talked to my mom about it, she was like, eh, in the future you're going to have to move it because we're going to run out of space. And she said, if I move it down here in the basement, then um, it can be somewhat permanent. And I thought that'd be an awesome idea. So we Sounds awesome. Yeah, we scoped out. Um, I scoped out the area, and I was like, "Oh yeah, this this looks awesome." I had an idea for it, and um, you can see pictures of it on Instagram if you're curious of what it looks like. Yeah, if not, I'll just probably put some. Uh, oh yeah, put it on screen right now. Yeah, I'll, I'll put it on the screen on uh, YouTube. This should be on SoundCloud as well. SoundCloud. Ooh, we're a big Ooh, big SoundCloud. game right now. <laughs> SoundCloud. Is it gonna be on the same account as your music account? Yeah. Oh. It just, just has everything on it. Just everything. If you haven't listened to the, this man's music. Oh god, I, it's terrible. I, it has a, a charm to it. One one song has one charm to it. Uh, I like the charm is uh, staying up till three in the four in the morning, just working on it. Yeah. <laughs> god, that was a good few days. That first few days. Was that the first night you got back? Yeah. Uh, no, I'm not sure. I think it was around the first time. I think so, dude. I think it was... I don't know. It was one of the first few days. That's all I know. That I came back from Oregon. Right. Neo was staying the night. Diego was staying the night. He was my son for a bit. I had to take care of him. You know how it is. But, yeah. Um, and so as for the basement, we kind of just been working on it little uh, day by day. And uh, it's definitely cleaned up a bit. Um, it's only been about two or three days since we've actually worked on it, and it actually looks so much better than the first day. So I'm um, pretty proud of that. Yeah, there was dust everywhere. We had to sweep, mop, all that good stuff. And we don't even have electricity at the moment, so that's we, pretty funny. We do have electricity. Well, we don't have, uh, the lights don't turn on. Yeah, we, we have electricity. Lights. Yes. So we have like a lamp and some... We have some like fairy light type outdoor bulbs. Yeah, whatever that is. I don't know. If you know what that is, you know what that is. That's how it works, baby. So what's on your phone right now? What you doing? Um, what's more important than this podcast? I'm I'm just looking at um some bears climbing a tree. Oh, um, put that on the screen right now. All right, now, I saw that. <laughs> that was pretty funny, right? It was pretty cute. Some bears on some trees, right? Sure, 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 yeah. This is going really well for the first one we had in a while. Well, yeah, I mean, we actually have stuff to talk about. It's only been like a year. Only been a year. That's crazy. No, but we're all growing up. He looks 20 times different than how he did a year ago, in my opinion. I kind of look retarded. I mean, we all did at one point. We all look crazy because of uh, the pandemic and everyone growing their hair out. You trying to say something, pal? I'm saying we all look crazy because we all have crazy long hair. Oh. For example, take a look at Billy. Only bring, bring up a picture of Billy. Alright, now that you saw that, wasn't that pretty great? <laughs> yeah, that was pretty epic. Look at Neo. Dang, that was awesome. Wasn't yeah, it? that was so cool, dude. dude. He has pure bluish greenish hair now. Bluish greenish hair. It's not the half and half like it used to be in that, in that one episode of the cooking with Ian. Yeah. Special episode. Yes. Yes. So, you want to talk about your new cat? Oh yeah, I got a cat uh, about two or three days ago. His name is Muggs, and he's um. Hold on a second. Here's a, here's a picture of Muggs. Yeah, he's a he's a Persian. He's a white Persian, and he cries a lot, and dirties his face, and uh, he looks like a grumpy old man, and it's kind of cute. Explain how you wake up in the morning. Oh yeah. Um, well, the past two or three days since I've had him, I I wake up and early in the morning, early for me at least, and um, it, I can't breathe in my room, my room doesn't have any windows or anything, um, and he kind of just poops on the floor with uh, blood covering his poop, and the, the miasma gets so thick that um, it, it kind of just chokes me until I wake up. The aroma of it. Yeah, it's, it's pretty bad, and um, so I clean it up and then go back to sleep for a few hours. How many hours did you get last night? You said earlier this morning you got three, but then I heard you fall back asleep around 10-ish? Yeah, I, I woke up because uh, Muggs 
was pooping again. Big stinky poo poo. And uh, I looked at the clock and I was like, oh my god, I, I only had three hours of sleep. And uh, at the time I thought I was going to stay up, but I went back to sleep and woke up around 1, I think, 1 or 12 p.m. That's, that's pretty good. That's a few hours of sleep there. Ooh, you're yawning, make a meal on. Yeah, that's crazy. That is crazy. That's science, baby. Well, so what's, do you have any future plans? Like, do you have any of that thought out yet? Or Future plans? What do you mean? Like, career-wise, like, education-wise? Um, no, I mean, I guess... The end of high school is coming. Oh, it's coming, dog. Oh, dude, it's coming. And I'm not even sure if I'm going to graduate or not, because this whole thing is crazy. But mm. hopefully I will. Um, worst comes to worst, I just have to do a longer summer school. But um, I'm going back to Oregon for senior year. Uh, I'm going to finish up my year there and probably do two to four years of college in Oregon, so I'll probably be there for a while. Um, which kind of sucks, but obviously I'm gonna come back and visit. Gotta see Ian. Yeah, see me. Like, there's no other choice, dude. You have to see me. Yeah, that's true. Also, I really hope that the, uh, put a picture of this up on the screen right now. Is a meme between us not? Huh? The, get a picture of this on the screen real quick. The, that we've been doing for this probably past 11 minutes now. Wait. The pull a picture up or whatever. Like we were talking about the room and shit. Like oh, pull a picture up. Like yeah. it's gonna become a meme now between us. Oh okay. Yeah. Sweet. There's no change in that. Oh okay. Yeah okay. no, this is happening. Yeah, I hope it sticks. Oh, I hope it sticks. Yeah, I hope it sticks more than like a wooden thing in the forest. What? A stick. You're just a stick in the mud. Yeah. So college. You're planning on going to college for four years. Um, at least, yeah, I mean... Well, do you have an idea on what you want to master, or get uh, your education? Not really, probably just... I don't know, I only have interest in photography and film right now. Um, but you I know... I think you should go to like a film school, you could probably get some good stuff done. Yeah... You have the talent for film, like, the, your, at least your editing style, it like... It's always like, a bit top tier. It's it's okay. For I mean no I mean if like what your resources are, and thank you. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah. Nope. Oh man, dude. For the, the listeners on SoundCloud, if there is any, we just shook hands. Very much. <laughs> we shook hands. It was awesome, dude. It was a bro moment. It was a bro. Bro, 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 bro man. Oh. So so Billy and uh, well Billy mainly. Also, sorry if Billy, if you listen to this, but he's been kind of blowing you off. <laughs> yeah, um, so he was supposed to come to that. <laughs> I um, I've been inviting Billy to hang out the past for for a while, for a few, couple of weeks, mm -hmm. and about five times now he said that yeah, I'll definitely see you, or yeah, I'm on my way. And every time he, he doesn't show up and he doesn't text me back or answer any of my calls. Mm -hmm. So it's it's kind of just a big meme that um, Billy doesn't respond to me. <laughs> All he does is after maybe three hours, he likes my message and doesn't actually respond to it. <laughs> I can confirm that does happen. Pull up on screen right now. That's <laughs> We're not doing that. That was, that was a fun. That was a meme. <laughs> yeah, meme. A uh, meme. See, I love memes. But, but no, Billy, it has been blowing Diego off mildly recently. And, uh, Toby's been blowing all of us off. So, Toby has a, a woman in his life. Oh, yeah. Yeah. I'm not gonna name drop her or anything. But, yeah, no, they've, they've been seeing each other. They seem happy together, which I'm happy for them. Yeah, obviously, it's, it's good for him. Right. But he's, um, there, there's like a, a line, and he, he's definitely, he definitely steps all the way over. His life is entirely... It surrounds her now. Yeah, it's completely... I mean, he did get a job as a... Like, he landscapes now? Yeah, he got a job today, right? Today? Yeah. Uh, or what, no, it was yesterday. Was it yesterday? Oh, uh, yeah, because he was talking about his arms. Yeah. Uh, so, totally got a job doing landscaping work with his friend's uncle, yes? I think that's right, yeah. Yes. Uh, but yeah, he does landscape work around town, where we live. And yeah, he's making good money, hopefully. And hopefully he can continue to be the the car... What are you doing with the corn? I'm just, 
All right, but hopefully you can continue to drive us around, and because that was some bueno times. I'm just, I'm just. We can, we can get our license. Don't make fun of us. I have um. The DMVs are closed. We can't get our license. Yeah, the, um, all the kids or all my friends that are younger than us is like are like, oh, I can't wait to get my license before you do, because it's a big joke that we've had like a year. Yeah, to get. Yeah, we're 17 now. Yeah, we're 17 and we still haven't gotten our license. It happens, so. What can you do? What can you do? Um, we, we can't do drive. it. We can't. <laughs> <laughs> That's I mean, legally we can't drive. Yeah. Yeah. Cut this out. <laughs> 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 nah. We're leaving everything in. There's nothing we're cutting out. We're, but we are putting stuff in for the comedic and the, the viewing pleasureness of oh, this. No. But it's nice to talk about stuff in on this, and it's nice to share feelings, Diego. Isn't that right? Mm -hmm. Do you want to talk about anything? <laughs> sure. Um, so what's what what's been on your mind? What, what have you been bottling up? What's what's in that in, in that emotional roller coaster of yours? I don't, I don't know, but um. <laughs> <laughs> not okay. Let's not talk about that unless you want to. I I, I just I'm gonna talk about um, cause our uh, podcasts have kind of a, a, a faint theme, um, re reappearing theme or whatever, uh, which is false promises. Oh, false promises. Yeah, mainly, mainly, almost completely my fault. Uh, Would you get a bell for the false prom? prom? Uh, let's continue, continue. <laughs> okay, well, if, if you pay attention and you, you realize all the projects we're talking about never come to life. Don't tell me. Uh, yeah, don't tell me, <laughs> and there's a few other ones, and, um... Well, I mean, we have this summer to, to work on Don't Tell Me. Well, yeah, we, the... I would have worked on Don't Tell Me, but we have mics that I haven't had the time to really check on how they work. Oh, yeah. And then also the location for the first, um, or the pilot, I guess, was supposed to be at Toby's, and he's not, he's not letting anyone... I mean, he could change his summer, hopefully. Yeah. Or if this pandemic goes away. Why does he have a job? Didn't he say he couldn't go out? Yeah, that's. I was honestly thinking that. I was going to say something, but... Oh, man. He, I uh... But, I mean, we can go to Neo's house, perhaps. Like, do you need the inside building part? Or do you just need the outdoor area? No, it's just going to be in his in his area. In his house, and then... Well, I mean, if anything, we can, like, film in my house or something. Then film up in TriStar. Different days. Cause, what do you mean? I mean, because Neo lives out there. Yeah. So we can, like, film in my house, like, the parts we need, then film in TriStar parts we need. If I'm being honest, I haven't gotten farther than the first episode. Well, hey, an episode to start. Netflix, if you're. <laughs> <laughs> give us a show. <laughs> Netflix. Netflix gives everyone shows. Yeah, that's a big meme. That is a big meme. Um, but Netflix. Hey, I, I, just wanted, I just wanted to address uh, that. The false promises uh, are possibly this band ever happening and the finishing of this basement man man cave thing. All right, I'm dedicated to both the band and the basement, but not I mean not dedicated, but I'm down to get with it. Yeah, I'm down to get jiggy with it. I nice. I am too. Oh, I'm definitely. I'm, I'm like sadly this basement is what I think about every day. Uh, no, I I actually really. I admire that. It gives you motivation, like, oh, I gotta get this done, like, all that. Yeah, I spent my birthday working on it all day. It was pretty fun. Oh, yeah, happy birthday. His birthday was, like, about a week or two ago. It was f five, six, yeah, a week ago. Yeah, about a week ago. About a week ago. About uh, Bobby Schmurr is free. <laughs> so, um... I, I, I do want this band thing to happen, but we're probably going to have some... Bumps in the road? Bumps in the road, of course, and also just the obstacle of all of us having little to no musical talent. Hey, I can play a mean horn. <laughs> I can play a mean triangle, as <laughs> Billy would probably say. I'm going to play the, the mouth harp. <laughs> you know, the... You know? Bing, bing, bing. Pull a picture up. I don't know what that is. 
Um, so... <laughs> Hold on, real quick. I want to just address the time on this uh, recording is about to reach the current year we're in. Oh. You ready? You ready? Oh. Happy Bonsai! New Year! Happy New Year! Yeah. Oh. Weeb. Weeb. Trash. Nightmare. Nightmare. <laughs> Stupid. <laughs> No, that's a reference to something, if you get that, then awesome. Oh, right? Yeah, dude, that's awesome. Nightmare, nightmare. <laughs> Somebody ordered a pizza ball. Isn't that that one show? Bird Up. No, Squid Neutral. Ah, oh, that's something else. <laughs> I don't know what that was. Uh, the one, uh, anime guy. Decados, and his whole thing's like squids or whatever. Do you know? Do you know? No. no? Pull a picture up. All right, let's get back to it. So, the band. You just think none of us have musical talent? Well, I'm, I'm just saying, um, right now, um, we only have kind of me, Ian, and possibly Billy, who are down for the band. And I'm pretty sure Neo was. I believe Neo is too, but something tells me he's not going to put as much in as the rest of us. Really? I would think he would. I feel like if he sees everyone else putting effort in, he'll put effort in too. I hope so, honestly. Yeah, no. I have faith in Neo. You Although, I, I do man. think that Neo's holding some secrets of some pretty awesome music, musical skills. You think he's hiding secrets from you? I, I, I feel like he's good musically. I... Okay. I, I wouldn't be surprised if he was. Oh, well, I feel like... I think that too, because he, he has tons of interest in like all these like musical instruments. Like he always wants to play. Like he plays, like, wants to play the guitar, wants to play the piano, wants to play my trumpet, and all that. Like, which I respect that because he's going out of his like and trying out new things, which I respect. Yeah, I, I, I wouldn't be surprised if he was a natural with some of the stuff. So, I'm... he's pretty good on keyboard. Sorry to interrupt. He's good with pianos. Like, yeah, nah. he no, he's like a really quick learner. Like he like watches those videos and stuff, and he gets it down. Like, I'm not surprised. But uh, I was reading up on band stuff, and it just talks about everyone's got to put in the same work, and then everyone should uh, you should kind of spread out the responsibility of the band to all of the members. What do you mean by responsibility, like? Uh, I, if, if we have time, I'll talk about it, but what do you think? I'd say we, we could go for like a whole hour, or half an hour. How long do you want this to go for? Nah, I don't care, it's just gonna take longer to, you know. Oh yeah, editing will be kind of a pain. Yeah, editing and then just rendering and uploading it and everything. I'd say, do you want to go for 45 minutes? We can go for whatever, I don't really care. Well, I mean, it sounds like you care because you brought it up. Not gonna lie. No, I was, I was just. Oh no! Oh, right issue. <laughs> Sorry. Continue. Uh, so here I have some screenshots. Yeah. Actually, no, I just talk about it. Um, so I stayed up researching about bands and stuff, and mm -hmm. it's, it talks about how obviously having a band is like the number one thing that uh, breaks up friend groups, kind of a lot of fights and everything, and um. It's the thing that I was reading the article or whatever even suggested that everyone writes a, a contract um, for the whole band and obviously not to do it right away because it'll scare all the band members but once things start rolling to do a contract and kind of discuss who has um, the rights to the name and who if someone leaves who like is the next band leader or whatever and how they're gonna find more people it's kind of just if anyone leaves or just doesn't want to do it anymore obviously unless everyone feels that way the band still has to keep going so so it's like a business kind of yeah it most definitely is a business um, and it kind of is run that way as well uh, some of the Jobs consisted of someone taking care of advertisement, someone taking care of scheduling, and someone taking care of finances, and someone kind of taking care of well, like uh, finding the, the places to play. Yeah, yeah, like finding shows, booking yeah. uh, shows. I mean, and also, uh, what you would call it, kind of finding that sound for everyone. 
Alright, so like, kind of like saying what to play, kind of, but not really, but I, I get what you're saying. Yeah, it, it warned that um, you're going to struggle a lot more if uh, not everyone in the band is putting in an equal effort. And that's kind of just what I'm scared about, and um, obviously not just for my friends, but myself. I, I don't know, I'm, I feel like we all have somewhat controlling personalities, which I, I personally like, but <laughs> I think with something like this, it, it might get in the way. But again, I, I still have faith in this. I'm just saying that it's going to be a bumpy road to get it started. Alright, alright. So, like you mentioned, there's a leader, yes, or did you not mention that? Yeah, no, uh, I'm not sure if I did or not, but I yeah, there, is, there, there has to be a band leader. Right, so... Uh, you get really associated with the leader of the group quite frequently, yes? I guess. I feel like I hear people say that, and I personally think of you as a leader. Thank which, you. I'm sorry if you don't like that. No, I don't, it doesn't bother me in the slightest. It just feels... I don't know. It's, How it, do you, I, it's it, feels, just, it feels weird, like, having someone older than you look up to you. <laughs> no, I don't <laughs> see you as older than me either. I, I know, I don't see age when I'm talking to people that yeah. I'm good friends with. Um, no, it's kind of just, how, how do you respond to that? Like, you're a good leader. How do you respond to that, really? I, you can't. I uh, just say, <laughs> thanks, I will lead you to forever. Because <laughs> the, the whole I, ideation of leading is kind of gives me slavery vibes, and I just kind of oh. don't like it. I think of like more political type of like presidency or something like that, but I know that, that would probably be a better thing. But yeah, no. you went to the to a bad place. <laughs> yeah, that's just where my head goes every time. Oh, okay. <laughs> so that's why you play a lot of Red Dead. <laughs> wow. <laughs> nah, I'm just messing around. Um, pull, pull a picture of that. <laughs> pull the clip of him beating up civilians in uh, Saint Denis. I, I don't know what you're Oh, okay. He did pronounce the name right though, so I got to Saint Denis. <laughs> You like that, don't you? I really don't. Yeah. Um, but, yeah, there's some... Um, for the... For the band. Band leader. Um, they have to, uh, obviously give everyone critique when doing band practices. Like, if someone's lacking or someone needs extra help or if something doesn't sound right, they have to be, they have to be the one to be like, hey, man. Yeah. That sounds like shit. Yeah, yeah, we gotta pick it up. Alright, so, what would you do if, like, someone will just get angry at you for criticizing them? Like, would you just be like, time out for a day, or like, we're done for the day, or would you want to be like, keep going? Uh, obviously, keep going. Um, but, if, like, what if they're, like, about to, like, beat the shit out of you or something like that? Then, like, then, we, then we'll talk in private. Right, like, talk about, alright, I respect that. Because, um... I'd, I'd rather get my ass handed to me than break up a band, honestly. Or a friendship with that. Yeah, yes. of course. Yeah, yeah. No, the band's more important. <laughs> more important. <laughs> I mean, there honestly is some bands like that. They only are doing it because it's a job, and they stopped caring about the friendships that they had in the past. Yeah. Which is kind of a sad thing to happen, and yeah. I don't want to happen to us if this does happen. Yeah, of course. Right. Um, uh, another big thing is... um. Yeah, uh, brain dead. Ah, oh, brain dead. That is a good topic. <laughs> um, j just the importance of keeping the band together. I think because I, I honestly, it even starting it up or just getting situated, I think is gonna be the hardest part of it. Um, because right, the financial investments of buying instruments and yeah, spending time practicing and learning how to play said instrument. It is a big investment. It, it's just, also gathering everyone for um, band practice is a must. Like you, you have to continuously practice, or else you're not going to make any progress. Right. And flexing the flexibility of everyone's schedule is going to be kind of tough. Oh yeah, for sure. Now that me have a job and Toby, if he's in this, like I think he would want to because he's an awesome bass player. Yeah. So I think he'd want to be a part of this because he always talks about being in a band. At least he has. That's another thing. Um, we're, we're kind of... I, I like to think we're somewhat of a diverse group. Oh, and, yes. Most definitely. And we're, um, 
we all like different sound. We all have different, we all like different uh, genres of music, and I think, well, when I was reading the thing... But hold on real quick, can we all agree that country is the best genre of music? Oh, uh, dude, I, I... I love John Cash. I just Cash. love country. It sounds... Country Roads. So... We are doing a cover of Country Roads. <laughs> country Roads. No, I'm... I, Take no. Alright, that's enough. Sing it for this. Do the please. Uh, right. th that I belong, West Virginia. Mountain Mama. Take me home. Country Roads. Alright, I was beginning to think this was getting a bit too serious. So thank you for putting in that comedicness. Oh, yeah. Of course, yes, thank you. Alright, so we were saying something, but oh, the diverseness of the group. Yeah. So, everyone has their own taste. You are more of a indie rock, yes? Something like that. Something. I, I like I like about almost all genres except for um, mumble rap and country. I'm almost there, but I kind of enjoy mumble rap. I just can't sing it. I, like, Sometimes it's trash, but sometimes the beat's good, and it, like I can vibe with it. <laughs> but yeah, I'm pretty. I uh, Toby himself, he's like, he's metal, or no, he's kind of indie rocker too. He he likes metal, um, metal rock, and, like all that good stuff. Like I can vibe with about everything. Uh, Billy, he is a he likes rap, rap, hip hop, all that. Yeah, shit. he likes yeah. Tyler the Creator. Hey, I like him too, so don't, don't, don't bring up my man in that tone of voice, dog. <laughs> yeah. So. See, it's, it's going to be a bumpy road, man. It is going to be a bumpy road. Um, but I think. We will know, find something that we all will be like, this is it. Yeah, of course. Be it mumble rap or country music. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, I can't wait to play the mouth harp. We're also gonna have to assign stuff because originally Billy wanted to be um, a bass player or electric guitar. It was yeah, electric guitar. Um, and then now he's thinking on doing the drums, and obviously he had, I don't think he's played any. He doesn't have a lot of like. He has no knowledge. Yeah, of he has no knowledge of it. So we're gonna have to experience is a better word. Yeah. Because he does know what a drum set is. Yeah, obviously, but... <laughs> yeah, we're just going to have to all learn an instrument, which sucks, and, uh... You're pretty good with the guitar, in my opinion. Like... That's an acoustic, though. I don't, I don't Autistic? Think... <laughs> I'm not sure if it's going to fit well with what we're going to do, honestly. Well, I mean, we can, like, throw in a, every now and like, acoustic thing. Yeah, that's something I definitely want to do, is change up the sound every once in a while. Yeah, no, yeah, definitely. Like, we could even, like, throw in, like, a whole, like, synth, like, piano type. For sure. Yeah. Get rid of the drums, put in the piano. Actually, nah, drums are kind of... Drums are kind of a fundamental yeah. asset to it. So, singing, uh, you said you would be interested in that, and I also said that. Yeah, I think someone else did as well. Did someone? Did Neo say something? I don't think it was Neo, I think it... It was someone else. I think it was just me and you, not gonna lie. Yes? I, I can't remember. I'll, unless, I'll someone, word for it. unless someone like personally messaged you and I have no clue about this. I remember me and you talked about this. Yeah, before. for sure. So that's that's gonna be odd. Um, I I wouldn't mind any any being in any position other than a bass player. Anal. So, <laughs> Alright. <laughs> Pull a picture up to that. Okay. <laughs> well. Uh, so we're gonna have a singer, a bass player, electric guitar, and drums, and I I'm gonna fit somewhere in there maybe hopefully. So did Neil say what he wanted to play? No. Okay. Like I think at one point a long time ago he said something. It was Abby. Was it Abby? Abby said she wanted to sing. She did, didn't she? Yeah, that was that. Yeah, no, yeah, we can get Abby, you know? Yes. <clears throat> oh, yeah, we can. Pull the picture of that. <laughs> Alright, now, but Neo, I remember a long time ago, said he would be interested in playing piano. Yeah. Any. 
But unless somebody has one, it's probably gonna I mean, we can buy like an electric, like, keyboard and stuff, like a keyboard and all that. Oh. This thing's gonna run out of space. Um, let's wrap it up at 40-ish. How about that? Yeah. So do you have any final thoughts you would like to talk about for how these next about five minutes? Uh, I don't know. We're trying to keep updates with with the podcast, hopefully. Yeah, we, we could try doing a weekly thing, but that would be a lot of work, and we don't have many topics. We can try getting like more people on here. So maybe Billy, maybe Neo. Neo, I was trying to get in on this, because I thought he would have enjoyed this, personally. Yeah, probably. Yeah, no, I I'm, sure, I'm sure Billy, Neo, and Toby all would have done it like this, because we, I mean, you've done it with all of them, besides, besides Neo, right? Yeah, besides Neo. Besides Neo. And we could get others, like, other guests, like our friends and stuff. Although, if, uh, the scene from the previous podcast, having Billy and Toby together, they, they, I don't know, they get all giddy, kind of, and they can't take anything seriously. Really? I, it, it's weird, that duo, kind of, they just, I they feel like, really funny. I feel like they're siblings when they're together, because... Yeah, it's, it's mid-on. Like, they either get along really well, or they, like, are just, like, yelling at each other, messing around and stuff. Yeah, I did hear that they were fighting while I was going. Yeah, it was... Uh, it was I it wasn't really fine. I feel like I don't know how to explain it, but they're they're still friends. But yeah, we can get some people on here, like other than the thirty five AM group. We could try guest calls. <laughs> we, we could get guest calls, or we can invite them down to the basement. Dude, I want to invite so many people down to my base the basement. You said someone was coming over, possibly on Thursday. Oh yeah. I wanted to invite Zion. I haven't seen Zayden in a really long time, and I wanted to see if I could try to see him. I heard he's been going to the gym, is that true? Yeah, I, I believe he is going to the gym. Well, that is crazy. Do you think he's a muscle boy now, or do you think he's still a skinny old man, little man he was? I think he's definitely going to be a little more built. I've, I've noticed that everyone kind of is at this age, kind of. Do you think, does he, has he gotten a haircut anytime soon, or has he still got that I have no clue. I... I with with my knowledge, I wouldn't expect him to have a haircut. Right. He was always funny. I had him a sophomore year in civics, and we would sit next to each other and meme around, mm -hmm. and nap and stuff, and share my food I got from first hour in culinary. It was a good class hour, in my opinion. That's funny, because Zion would always share his food with me since freshman year. Oh, that's awesome. I forgot how I met Zion. Didn't you mean like at that table? Like, weren't you like saying with like Ariane or something? Something like that, yeah. Yeah, it was in the boiler room at least. Like, was it Joey? No, maybe? No, I don't know who you were talking to back then. I'm not sure, but we, we had the same boiler block and I was like, oh shoot. Well, that, that probably fits. Yeah. Nicely. And then he got me into Fortnite and Overwatch. He got you into Overwatch? No, Toby got me into Overwatch, but. I thought I got you into Overwatch. No, no, I got Toby in the Overwatch. Yeah, that's how it works. I don't think so. I did no, I, I, I let him. No, I don't know how. I'm pretty sure. I think you just played. I think I we. I played before you guys though. Yeah. Yeah, I'm pretty sure Toby. But did we know each other? <laughs> we did know each other because Overwatch came in 2016, and hmm. that was like eighth gradeish. Was it not? So that was. I don't know. <laughs> it's weird that we can't remember. I don't know. But we are running out of time. We have a minute left of this. If we, yeah. Let's go out and keep going. Um, camera only says we have two minutes. Alright, so yeah, let's finish this up within a minute. Uh, yeah, I guess. Yeah, you get it. I, right. This should be the end, I guess? Yeah, this should be the end, I guess. So how do you want to end this? Just, we'll see you next time. We hope you enjoy listening. We'll try to do another one semi-soon. Um, probably not going to try to rush anything in my thoughts, um, because we got a lot of stuff to focus on, but, um, if Zion comes over, we'll definitely try to do something to, again. As long as he consents, of course, because cons consent is yeah. key. Yeah, and today is May 5th, um, so this will probably be up, um, I, December. I was going to say, I'll give it like four months. <laughs> yeah, it's going to be a while. Right. So, uh, well, thanks for listening. If you did listen, I hope you enjoyed. Man, that's about it. And we'll see you later. Bye-bye, Dad.